Well, I've been fortunate to work both in restaurants and education throughout my life. It has been something that I, I feel a great deal of reward from both of those. Uh, in both cases, you're working a lot with other people and trying to help them in their current situation. They either need to get sustenance or they're trying to learn something. And for me, uh, the, the two actually played into each other uh, very well. And I was able to use my skills in both of those things to, I think, be uh, fairly successful. My cooking background is fairly simple. I learned mostly from uh, from my mother, my sisters, a little bit from my grandmother, and um, and from watching friends and friends' mothers in the Basque Country and asking a lot of questions. And so even though my cooking background is simple, I haven't had any formal education in cooking. I've been able to apply it to the kitchen in a, in a restaurant situation. And, and I always feel like what we're serving here is something that you could have at your grandmother's house. It's something that's very comforting. And yet there are uh, layers of flavors that I remember growing up that we're trying to recreate here. I just love the feel of this little spot. It feels like so many restaurants I've been to in the Basque Country. We were able to kind of develop our menu around the chorizo. Basque chorizos typically have four ingredients, the ground pork, salt, fresh garlic, and the pepper sauce. The pepper sauce comes from a, a pepper we call the choricero pepper. It's a green pepper. It can be eaten as a, as a fresh green pepper, but what we do is let that go dry or go red. Then we hang them and dry them. And then from that, we reconstitute that, make a pepper sauce from that. And that's our chorizo. I think Ansatz is a little bit unique in, uh, in what we're doing. We're trying to do something that you can bring a group of friends or family and it's affordable for uh, small and large groups. Uh, we have great uh, variation or diversification on our menu. We have, we're able to take care of special dietary needs and yet still fill your plate and your appetite with great flavors that maybe you've never tried or they're flavors that you had when you were a young child and you're like, oh, that's what grandma used to serve us. So um, I would invite everyone to come see us at some point and I hope you have a great meal with us. Mm -hmm.